Hi everyone. I'm back with um, an, a video that um, I made some stamps out of fun foam. I'll show you what it looks like. My son got me this um, a while from my, I think it's for my birthday. And um, it's been sitting around. And I watched a, a few videos that everybody making stamps their stamps out of fun foam so I decide to give it a go so I'm going to show you all the one that I made out of fun foam and my chipboard that I put it on I got it for free is to work where they have like a large supply of this so I asked my boss one day and they, he cut up a bunch of these little squares for me so it's been like eight years ago I have all these so now I got used for it I'll show you all the one that I made. I made um, a swirly one. I made a cloud. I made um, different shapes. I made a heart. I made like a starburst. I made a flower. And um, this one here come off of um, this that I punched out. The little circles that's this one came off of that is just something random that you know good for journal or you know put some paint on it and it's good for stamping then I made the flower all I did I just put an impression on it I didn't do nothing else I just put a take a pencil and I mark it down as a flower I made a rose freehand style I made a rose I made a sun, a face of a sun. I made some circle, a bigger circle, like if you want to do a bigger page. Uh, this is some random pieces I cut out, sorry. Uh, and these are some pieces here and there that comes off of, um, the pieces that I cut, like you know. When you cut, you have all these little pieces. So I went in there and I cut a bunch of little pieces. This is one with my stars that I draw. Draw out a bunch of stars and I glue it on here. This is a journal for your journaling. I cut the strips and I just glued them on there. Then we have this random piece of bits and pieces of here and there come out of the scraps too then I did some squares I did some um, this over here I used my um, my scissors this one here and I cut out two and then I put some more random piece in there so that's that one this one made out of shelf lining this one made out of skewer I haven't used them yet I'm just showing you guys what I made and I gone crazy making it this one made out of the swab that you clean your ears and I cut out the the cotton ball and I just glue it on there so these are some of the one that I made like these are the big ones that I made and um, I made a few more that a few more that I'm gonna share with you guys as soon as I clean this mess up and put stuff aside yeah, these are all I used up. I'm using up my chipboard, so I have those. And these are all made on, these are bottle caps, recycled bottle caps that I, the bottle caps that I saved. And this is made out of shelf lining. I cut it like diamonds. Um, this is fun, fun foam. This is fun foam. That's a, a bow. That's a, a butterfly. That's like if you don't want to use that big um that's you use your little your little ones like you go you know i'll show you and you just use your little ones to make like stamp and fill in your um your you know it works pretty good then the um but of the bow i'll show you how the bow works One second this is my bow that I made out of fun board, the fun foam, not board foam. And then 
I just go on stamping. That's that one. This one here is I showed you that one. The butterfly. I didn't show you the butterfly. That's my butterfly. These are my shelf lining. It's a diamond. And that's a diamond. This one here I use from recycle. When I punch this out, I use save this piece and I I just it's something random. This is a bigger, um, I think, it, yeah, almost a bigger diamond. I did like three different sizes of the diamond of the shelf lining. And this one here is like a, um, I don't know what you call them, but it's part of a shelf lining. So we have that. We have a bigger diamond. I love the shape of the diamond. That's a bigger diamond. We have another, this one here made out of shelf lining too. I like the way it comes out. It's beautiful shelf lining. Um, I'll change the color. And um, This one is some kind of random square of fun foam. This one here made out of fun foam. They're, don't forget, they're all recycled cap that um this one here it has like a hole like something that you can stick your finger in there and your finger helps you push like push push into the um it's, it's i like that this one here made out of scraps um fun foam too i like those i'm saving my caps so i'm gonna make some more different shapes that's a heart that made out of fun foam and um, there's this like a star it's all hand cut and there's a um, that's a different stars this is a, a like a like the real good stars that I cut up and I'm gonna stand there those all made out of fun foam and here's another one that made out of fun foam and um, all these I made out of the fun foam but um, I told my daughter that I need a bigger ink pad so I could use my um my bigger stamps so hopefully I will get some bigger um ink pads so I can use my um my bigger stamps um there's some some more of the uh, stamps I want to make and it's stuff that I want to use around the house I I grab some stuff like the dominoes and bottle caps and like the bottle caps um if you want to make a like a big circle this is a recycled bottle caps and i'm um, just gonna go in and uh, hopefully my paint is still and um i'll just go in there and just if i want to make a circle i use a bottle cap to make my circle and um you got a circle you know just use whatever you have around the house and make your circle and um, to make a few circle I I think I have an idea to make like a, a whole page of a circle out of recycle and um, once I get one ready and then I'll make a video and show you guys how I make how I make it and it's gonna be made out of recycle and that's kind of cool that you could use the stuff around your house just to um, make your stamps you know it's it's unique it's it's unique it's something that you know you make something you enjoy doing it's good it's good I like the idea that you could make your own stuff and it won't cost you that much to go you know buy a stamp and say I need a circle you could use anything and I'm using paint now I'm not using my ink pad I'm using paint like I have a bowl of paint over here and I'm using the copper and I'm just going in there and um, putting my circle on there you know and it, it looks really nice with the copper and then you you can make a few of these you know what i mean i'll show you something with a, um my son has um legos 
I'm gonna experiment with it. This is my Sun Lego and it has four holes. And if you want to um, make um, little little dots like that, that's from a Lego. Use what you got around the house and try to experiment and, and come up with your own idea, your own cool look, your own inspiration, your own, you know what I mean? It's, it's nice that coming up with your own ideas and use what you got around the house and go through your kids toys box and go through, you know, there's a, this way to get around not spending a lot of money and this here might be my I'm gonna start a journal I haven't done one and um, I have so much birthday card Christmas card anniversary card and I finally is finally gonna make a journal to put all the stuff in it and that's a cool cool journal page right there Lego I made those cir little circles out of Lego look at it look at the colors are beautiful I did I did this one here out of paint and I use a, um, I use a domino and the, the, this is the domino right here in here I use I had a bunch of those so it's gonna go into project but I just take a few of them to use and all these these circles came off of the uh, same bottle caps that I just did on this one it came off of that same bottle caps and um, these little circle came off of my son domino this is all paint so I have a few bottle of paints right here that I was using trying to um, come up with and knock myself silly in doing this video and um, yeah it came out good I did this one I did it's still wet and um, this one here I did too it's like a border it's a piece of um, strip came in some pack some kind of package so I saved it so there we go recycle this one I just did and that's that's that came up beautiful with the copper and those color that mixed in there is beautiful I like that um, I have some pieces I can try then I did uh, I did um, these when I was making all these stamps I use use this cardboard thing to paper to stamp so these are a few of this the one that I made and I came up with so all of these that I'm experiment with and um, I'm gonna put it in a journal I'm gonna make a journal not really put it in a journal I am gonna make a journal with all these paper that I'm background that I'm creating and um, it's gonna be a fun journal and um, I, I'm planning to make a junk journal too, so it's gonna be like a art art journal. Then it's gonna be I'm gonna do a junk journal, and then I'll go from there and see where it takes me. You know what I mean? I love to create stuff, create different things, and like I said, I do not edit my video. My video is it is what it is. I'm not gonna change something that I'm not we're all human and we make mistakes we're not perfect so I do not edit my video and um, if you're wondering what I'm working on I got this I bought it at a dollar store my took me to the dollar store and you get two for a dollar you get two for a dollar and I use it on top of my um my table and um, I have this this heavy heavy duty glass it's like oh my god um if i measured it i could tell you how how thick that is it's a half an inch this is like half like a half an inch thick glass table i got from my father-in-law 
um, one of his old antique table broke and they couldn't fix the, the fix back the um, the legs so I asked him and he gave me this and this glass is really really thick it's like half an inch thick and it's beautiful it's, so I use um, this come from the dollar store and it's you can wash them and clean them and you keep your you know your working area clean so get this dirty and um, don't dirty your your other stuff like your silicone mat or like, buy this this these are cheap just go to the dollar store and you get two for a dollar it worth it just spend a dollar and you get two so um yeah i've been experiment and um making a bunch of stamps and um i have all these fun from for so long that um watching all these videos making your own stems and um finally decide to give it a go and i have fun making it and i use um recycle um shelf lining like i have tons tons of these i don't use them but i save them for making project so i use that to make some and um recycle bottle caps in whatever you have around the house use it up um, if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel thank you for watching bye bye